So when we were designing this apparatus, we went over how we use the apparatus and we laid out things such as having our saw box up there where our saw is located for the firefighter to go right up to the uh, basket for ventilation of roofs and structures like that. Um, over here we have our newer generation of airbags all laid out so a firefighter can get to them easily with the cribbing that goes necessarily with the airbags. Uh, we also went to the next generation of hydraulic rescue tools. Uh, these are battery operated tools and we have them on a carousel so that the firefighters can get to the tools quickly and easily. Uh, he'll take out one of these tools and demonstrate. These are much quieter than our previous generation tools which relied on a po uh, gasoline powered engine. It was very difficult to talk over the tools when they were running. These are much more powerful tools than the previous generation and allow, allow for us quicker operation for vehicle extrication. Uh, we go back further, we can see that even the layout of the cabinets have been, uh, we sat down for a long time and designed each cabinet so we would carry the most amount of equipment for the best uh, possible outcome at um, all the scenes we go to. On the other side, we'll take a look at the new generation of uh, battery operated fan. This is the latest generation fan. It's a battery operated fan that allows us for one firefighter to get to a scene quickly and deploy the fan without having to run an extension cord. It provides much more greater airflow than what we previously had. And this is just a new generation of firefighting tool that we were able to uh, implement on the new truck. If we also look on the back of the apparatus, we see that we have our, uh, not only the aerial, but we have our new generation of uh, ladders. These are lighter than the previous generation of ladders we have, and we actually have more ground ladders than we previously had on, this, uh, on the truck. So we have much more capabilities of laddering structures when we go to them we have more ladders available to us. The new generation of handheld lights that we use for lightening up the scene at night uh, allows a firefighter to deploy these quickly and they provide uh, greater illumination to the lights than we had pr uh, the previous generation. So as be being on the truck company when we were go to a uh, structure fire where people may be possibly trapped or um, need rescue, the primary job of the truck company is to do search and rescue. Each member of this company is assigned a thermal imaging camera. This allows us to go inside a smoky environment and in most cases able to see through the smoke and able to locate uh, people who are trapped inside buildings.